Dishes with hearty marinara and tomato sauce are probably the first things that come to mind when you think of Italian food. But we're doing something a little bit different today. Of course, it's Mamma Mia Monday with Chef Joe Malia from Joe's La Roma. And uh, we're making fettuccine carbonara. That's right. We're going to do something different today. Oh, I know I'm usually excited. over here we say put a little bit of garlic today. No garlic. No gar we'll no garlic? No garlic? Garlic was dish today, yes. Getting bold now. Making a little fettuccine carbonara, wow. which is a cream, butter, and cheese based dish. So I'm going to put a little okay. bit of butter into the pan. And if, Jimmy, if you don't mind chopping up some of this pancetta, and we have some prosciutto as well. Am I chopping up? I'm not chopping up the prosciutto, right? No, just, no, the, just pancetta. the pancetta. It's a little rustic, a little. Okay. Now, I know a lot of folks use pancetta. Kind of, what, what flavor does that kind of so offer? So, the pancetta, if, if you see it, it's, uh, it's rolled uh, bacon. Mm -hmm. It's an Italian style bacon. Um, and then the prosciutto is ham. So, it's just a different spice, a little mm. bit dried. Um, is that about right? Yeah, oh, perfect. Okay. Ooh, uh, nice. Pork. Cool. So, it gives a little bit of flavor with a little pork fat and a little bit of butter in the pan. Ooh. And then we'll get uh, a little bit of Romano, Pecorino Romano, mixed with a little pepper. We're going to put Ooh. that in the pan. You say that so nice. Pecorino Romano. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> wow, I go. love that. This is a nice dish to be making, too, as we kind of head into the summer, you know, spring, summer. People want maybe something a little bit lighter. A little bit lighter. I mean, yeah. you think of butter and, and pork and a little bit of cream, it makes it heavy. But when you taste it, you'll see how light it it's, is. It's all about the taste. It's all about the taste. <laughs> Don't worry about Exactly. What we're putting in now, there. I will admit, I'm, I'm a texture guy, too. I like texture. Yeah. Right. You want to yeah. you, you want to taste different textures? Different right. Levels. Yes. Yes. Absolutely. I think you did a great job there, Jimmy. Wow. That looks <laughs> nice. Yeah. We'll Let's see take, how this works out. Take a little bit of this. Yep. I think we have enough oh, here. Wow. Oh, you good? All right. A little bit more. I'm just going to keep doing it because i got nothing else to do. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> Perfect. We're going to go ahead and fry this up in the pan. We're just going to turn it up a little bit here. Right. Yeah. Get it going. So. It's controversial this dish as far as what is authentic carbonara. Mm -hmm. um, you could do it with either prosciutto or pancetta. We're going to do both so we'll satisfy everybody, right? Oh, perfect. We'll do a little bit of both. The controversy is cream or pasta water. Well, and traditionally it's pasta water, but here in the States we're going to use a little bit of cream. So okay. don't come you're, at me. You're exercising your creative life. There we go. Yeah, this is your decision here. There we go. Ooh. We're going to do a little bit of cream. That's nice. Just a little bit. Like I said, we're going to add a little bit more cheese. And you don't even have garlic in there, and it smells no delicious. No garlic today. <laughs> the last time I was here, I was, there's garlic in everything, so okay. we're doing a little bit, bit different today. Right. Yeah. A little bit of fresh basil. Wow. I'm just going to fry it up a little bit. Cool. And how have things been going for you? It's been going well. Yeah? It's been going well. Especially being on Delmarva Life. Hey. And a lot of people that say, Say hi to Jimmy for me. Uh, are, they, are they asking for what you prepare for us? They are. They good, ask me good, when, good, I, awesome. if, when I'm done whether everybody eats it. I said that they can't get enough of it, right? That's the truth. Mm -hmm. So we're going to mix a little bit of fettuccine in here. I just oh, drained oh, this oh. fettuccine. And you can see it's kind of all mixed together there. We're going to add a little bit more cream, Katie, if you oh, don't mind. Oh, oh, yeah, sure. Just about half of that. Half of that? Yeah. All right. How's that? That's perfect. Oh, cool. And you can hear it frying up a little bit. Yeah. A little bit more cheese. Wow. How long have you been making this dish? It looks pretty good. Uh, I've doing a little bit of a long time, as long as I can remember. Uh, you, what are the dishes really? that I've been making? Just uh, by uh, looking at it, you can figure out what you need in it. That's right. You want to get a nice consistency there of everything put together. Yeah. And why the fettuccine noodles? Well, the fettuccine is built to hold a heartier sauce. Mm. If we did this right now with spaghetti, especially angel hair, we'd have a chopped up noodle. Yes. Oh, that mm. would be interesting to see. I would yeah. still eat it, though. I want you to understand that. Same. <laughs> I'll take the rest of that cream, if you don't mind. Um, well, okay, more. Sorry. And I think that uh, we just have to add an egg to it, and we can an egg. We can eat. Yeah. We're gonna well. take it off the heat. She's gonna crack an egg right in there. Ready? Go ahead. Oh, you're just going right for it. Going for the so egg. You take the raw wow. egg. Wow. Take it off the heat. This was this is the carbonara part of it. So the egg is cooking. It's not raw egg. Right. It right. cooks inside the pasta, and you see as I oh, oh, oh. as I do this. You'll see it kind of get a little bit golden, get a little body to it. Yeah. <gasps> Here we go. Oh my goodness. That, that egg really changed things. It changed everything, didn't it? It sure. seriously did. Joe, sure, I don't know how to tell you this. You've made me hungry. We'll wow. put this right on a plate. There we go. Mm. Add a little grated cheese, fresh Ooh. grated. Ooh, ooh. Oh, gotta get I think, fresh grated. I think we are. Uh... Look at that. There you go. All right. 
But do we have to take a break before we try this? We have to take a break before we try this. It's a little warm out of the pan if you just don't <laughs> stick around. Joe Belia is here to prepare our tell me again fettuccine. Fettuccine carbonara. Carbonara. We'll be right back. As you can see, the fettuccine carbonara has come together in an elegant and what must be a delicious way. You know why, too. Chef Joe Belia from Joe's La Roma has demonstrated his expertise once again for Mamma Mia Monday. Whew. Joe, what have you done? Time to try it, right? So is it good to go? Have you Anything coming up? We do. So we have uh, Mother's Day is coming up soon. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. We're going to do a nice right. little brunch. Uh, uh -huh. Do reservation brunch. We're going to be open from 11 to 3. Okay. And it'll uh, be uh, reserved whatever time in between. I, I am uh, guessing that you don't have a whole lot of room, so the earlier the better. The earlier the better, that's correct. Give them a call. Uh, give us a call or right. find us on Facebook and message us. Okay, okay, all right. Anything else? Uh, Tell us about Pizza Tuesday. So Pizza Tuesday, every other Tuesday, which is, is next Tuesday, uh, we do a takeout on uh, large pizzas we only offer on that Tuesday. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, call mm -hmm. in on Facebook or message, message on Facebook. Mm. I want to know how you pack this much flavor into this. Wow. And it's not, I mean, it's pretty light. For what yeah. the ingredients that we use, you would think it'd be a little heavier, but mm. it's not bad. Uh, the, the creaminess in the noodles, too, is like, oh. And it's I like delicious. the bacon, like you were talking about. Pretty mm -hmm. good. Yes. Oh, this yeah. is fantastic, Joe. Thank you wow. so much. Thank you. Once again, where can we find you? So we're located in 213 North Fruitland Boulevard in Fruitland, Maryland, mm -hmm. crossing the food line. Okay. And if you want this. If you want that, we'll be open Wednesday through Saturday. Fettuccine I, carbonara. Carbonara. I suggest you make reservations because we are a small restaurant and we do it pretty quickly. Now, here's my question. If I want this, mm -hmm. okay, and I should maybe, like, should I get a nice salad on the side? Sure. Well, we, comes, the good thing, it comes with a salad. Oh, it does? Okay. It comes with a salad. Or just, just a meals come with a salad. Choice mm -hmm. of salad or vegetable. Okay. Um, but a nice salad and maybe a little mahi bruschetta to start. Ooh. That's our, that's our special we made last week. And, uh, and that is yeah, also good. Wow. I'm sorry, go ahead. I was just going to. Oh, oh, yeah. oh. Jimmy's making a mess. Mm -hmm. Remember how we described this as elegant? Yeah. <laughs> it started that way. Yeah, don't go eat with me. <laughs> wow, yeah. Joe, again, thank you for a fantastic meal. Be sure to call ahead for Mother's Day, but stick around. Del Marvel Life will be right back. And maybe I'll, I'll wipe. Oh, come on. Really?